Jackson. Good fits. Good job, Spencer. Thank you. 
Thank you. I'll start proceedings off. I'd like to uh, welcome Paul O'Toole, and he's from the uh, SMJFL board, and myself, uh, Callum Hart. I'm the marketing and event sponsorship coordinator at the SMJFL, and I'd like to thank everyone for attending a magnificent day. We we're pretty worried about the weather, but it's turned out to be a pretty good morning so far, hasn't it, lads? 
Oh, good. Now, I'd like to take this opportunity to thank uh, our partners that put on the final series for us, uh, McDonald's and Monjon. And also, we'll be making some, some videos. You would have been seeing the guys with the cameras going around for the ground and for the anthem. Those, those videos will be available online, or you can either get them from DVDs as well. Also, there's some photos going around, but I'm sure with all the parents going around with a amount of cameras, I reckon you might have a few ready to go. Um, firstly, I'd like to thank the umpires, and I'd like to welcome them up to the stage. The first field umpire for the presentation is Josh Sinan. Uh, the pantry umpires were Lachlan Doyley and Ashley Doyley. And the goal umpires, Stephen Reinhardt and Sam Boyle. Thank you to the umpires. We'll give one massive round of applause. If it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be out of that game in the grand final to win. So thank you. And I would just like to yeah, make your way down. Thank you, guys. And we just got the votes in for the grand final, for the best on ground for this today's grand final. And we'd like to welcome up number 18 from Oakley. Come on up. Number 18 for Morty Alley. <laughs> Cheers, Jack. Thank you. And I'd like to wake up the, uh, the losing side, Morty Alley Gray side coach, Harry Seeger, just to say a couple of words on the game. Thanks, guys. Hi guys, thanks very much. It's been a great season, and first year coach for me and uh, Tony, and uh, we've been uh, watching you guys play and really improving through the season and doing an ama amazing job. And we've got a little relative connection between Sam and Callum, which has been a nice touch. And Sam has been coming down and watching a few of our games of late, which is probably, in hindsight, the wrong thing that happened. <laughs> So, um, firstly, congratulations to Jack, an outstanding player, and he'll be, uh, he's a ripper. And uh, you guys, in every spot today, played a great, great game of football. And uh, we had you matched for half the game, and then you broke away, obviously. So, I commend you all, Oakley. You've had a great season. You finished on top, and you ended up on top. So, congratulations to you guys. You deserve it. For our team. I can't be prouder. We had an uh, amalgamation of three teams into two. We grabbed a whole stack of boys from the split group and they came together as one. Within three training sessions, they trained well, different skill sets, and they didn't know each other. And we had a whole heap of new blokes as well come in. So what you see today is guys under 12s never played footy before until this year, taking their role and to win so many games this year with the group mixed is just a real credit and shows fantastic effort. So I commend my boys, you're fantastic. So, um, well done to your team and to your coach. And uh, yeah, and we'll see you next year, hopefully. And uh, yeah, that's, that's all I can say. Yeah, thanks. Thank you, Harry. Give a round of applause to Morty Alec and his team. Now I'd like to welcome the winning coach of the winning tie, Oakley Dragons, Craig Bryce. Thank you, boys. <laughs> okay, first of all, uh, commiserations to the Morty boys. Um, you had a wonderful season. The um, under-12 North is a very even, strong competition. You guys are on top right from the start of the, the season. I think you had about eight wins in a row at some stage, which is a phenomenal effort. 
I know you're feeling a bit disappointed now, probably, but um, I know you're such a skillful and talented team that you'll be back next year and be a force to reckon with once again. So well done, boys. Fantastic. Uh, the umpire, Josh, and the other boys, the boundary umpire, go umpires. Obviously, a great achievement to be appointed the go umpire for, uh, sorry, umpires for the grand final, and you did a great job. Well done, lads. Um, uh, Agri Dragons, uh, the committee, like, like any club, we're the same as all other clubs, like amazing amount of work done by a small bunch of people, very dedicated people, and um, to Bart and the rest of the team, on behalf of all the kids and all the, the families, you get so much enjoyment out of the club. Thank you very much. And uh, last of all, the under 12 Dragons themselves. Well done, let's. Starting here, we were sure we had you know, one team, two team, and how it was going to work out. And as it did, at the end of the day, you boys bonded together and you made that 29 and a huge strength and an asset to us. So well done. And now you can say your premiership players, the whole 29 of you. Well done, let's. That's it. First of all, I'll just go once I can see first. William Hebron. <laughs> Maxie Phillips. <laughs> Jack Martin. I'm Jackie. Josh Gorey. <laughs> Matty G. Ethan Delaney Spencer Smith James Hammer William Robinson Jamie Joey DeBoos Theo Oscar Sun Father Ben Donovan Angel McKenzie Lawson Colgrove Joshy Dean Daniel Tingas Wade McDonald Harry Boxall Cody Augusto Hayden Boyce Riley Kaleri Ethan Sherlock Jacko Sammy Carter Seb And the big Eric, the big guy Rodeo right, okay, guys, we'll just stay up on the stage, have a few photos, get all the trophies in and the flag, and then we'll be able to make our way until we'll get started for the next game. Congratulations, Oakley! Yeah!